So I've been told that apparently my secret Santa gift didn't fit under the tree. I, um, and it's been left in my base. I am, half of me is worried of what I'm going to meet, and the other half is interested. And somewhere in the middle is a whole bunch of dread. Um, where is my, I can never show up on the side of this thing. My portal's on. Because I can't remember what random blocks look like when they go together. I can never find my own portal. Where are we? There it is. So if you haven't seen this thing, this glorious conglomeration of yellow and orange, uh, it's a tree. It's made out of, like, all kinds of weird stuff. And we've got a glass safety net down there so people stop falling to their deaths. I'm sure this will look absolutely awesome with, like, clear glass texture. Don't ask me where he came from. But he's staying down there. Yeah, can't hit him. I really wish I knew what Gexu had planned for this. I was really interested in seeing what what was going to become of all this. But anyway, let's head back to my base. This tunnel needs so much love. I mostly just bricked it in so I wouldn't have to worry about stuff happening from the outside. I did nowhere near enough uh, roughing it up. So it looked like a ruin. And then I hit spots where I wasn't sure what to do. Someday, someday. So, uh, my vines are getting a little out of order again. You know, I have, I have string on me. Let's do something here. So we want to go like that and there, and then you are there. Does that stop you off? We finally blocked in. Okay, stop being herpes. Let's get back to the base, shall we? Down here. I probably should have run this up one higher. I probably will someday. We'll get to it here. Uh, well, yeah, here, I think. Somewhere along this line, we'll raise it up one. That way we can put a gold block in like the rest of them. And let's visit the base, shall we? Do -do -do -do. And through. Ah, yes, the base. Why I built you at Y10, I'll never know. You seem like a great idea until I remember that slime chunks are a thing. Uh, where did he put it? I'm going to guess it's up top. Probably up top. So let's go up top. Is it in here? My tree farm? Nope. Did I show you guys this? This is... Is how much space this thing takes up. So we're on a 4x4 four four map here. That. And this whole thing, these. These rivers had to get widened. Can you tell they were rivers to start with? That one I had to build. Not bad. I think they turned out okay. I think if uh, if we kept this map for 114, it would look, this setup would look a lot more awesome. Um, I'm guessing that's a present. What does it say? Oh my god, that's the ugliest Christmas sweater I've ever seen. Uh, I think it's slightly too big for me. It might be just a little bit too big, you know, how they look at it? I mean, uh, uh, we were only, what, da, 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 only, what, eight pixels wide? I'm only... Like, uh, I'll admit, I am I might be a big boy in real life, Griff, but that... I'll grow into it, I guess. <laughs>
Let's put my armor back on so I can protect it. Uh, oh, I can still see the sleeve. It's, uh, <clears throat> it's a gift. It's certainly a gift. It's, uh, it's, it's an atrocity. It's a gift. And I'll, uh, I'll treasure it always, Griff. I'm very, very happy you gave it to me. Um, hmm. I'm, uh... Yeah. Alright, we're over here at Green's. It's Green Matthias. He's, uh, working on this wonderful Chinese-themed place. These banners are amazing. I... I like them more and more every time I see them. He just looks so awesome. So anyway, Green has a slight problem. He has a bunch of caves underneath his base that aren't lit up. Green also has a second problem in that he doesn't cave. I will make no value judgments. I'm just stating that he doesn't cave. These are even, like, there's stuff in here, too. It's like, all I've done is dig a giant hole in the ground. He's got these, like, beautiful banners and his unified color scheme. Please looks so awesome. I feel like I've done nothing. Cow farm. Yep, it's cow farm. The way the lighting goes here, with the, the dark and the bright, <coughs> with the, uh, the fences, that's cool. Now, over here somewhere, here we are, a well. Down here, I don't know if... I'm taking the easy way. <laughs> so down here... <coughs> Sorry, just got a bit of a thing in my throat there. We popped down here once before. Oh, it does have the water. Okay, that's cool. We popped down here once before. For a quick bit of work, just to make sure the the opening area was safe. And as you can see, he's got an awful lot of an awful lot of dark spots in here. And we can hear some mobs already. Mobs that are too dumb to get themselves out of problems. Are you a mob? Nope, you just look like one. Let's go up here. All the way up here. I do this. Eh. That. And that. This seemed like a good idea when I started. You can go away. I didn't mean to kill the water, but oh well. Stuff happens. Just to get us a better view of up top here. <clears throat> so that's going to need some torches. You are something in leather armor. And now you're dead. And I have done the stupid thing of getting rid of my way down. So we're just going to have to come across here. See if we can't aim for... Um, the ground! Ah, hit it. First try. Got a lot of caves. Oh, hello. That got a little worrisome. You go over there. But you stay down there. There should be certain things that squid can't carry. So this doesn't happen. There's those zombies can't carry. Otherwise they just accumulate in caves. They never despawn. You were... What are you? Haha! <laughs> Didn't do any good, did it? <laughs> I'm going to fast forward a bunch of this. Because I don't have a whole bunch of commentary prepared. And we'll see how well it goes.
right. Um, cave's done. Wasn't a whole lot to it, unfortunately. Um, I was hoping that... Uh, I you hope to find something cool when you're caving, you know? Maybe like, find a spawner. Find, find something neat. But, uh... Well, Green, your cave didn't go very deep. Didn't go very deep at all, actually. And it wasn't as extensive as I had hoped. So, unfortunately, I didn't get to find as cool a stuff as I thought I would. Like I said, I hope to find a spawner, all kinds of neat things. But, well, sorry about that. Don't mean to disappoint. So, what we're going to do here, a quick chest. I'll make a crafting table quick, because I don't have one on me. Make a chest. Dirt. One of them. I have no sticks on me. Got sticks now. More of these. Because nobody carries signs on them. Uh, you can stay there. There, where did I put that? So I put stuff in this shulker box, right? Yeah, there we are. Right. Is that that? So the junk away. Now, Mr. Mathis, Matthias, how do I keep saying that? Now, Mr. Matthias, as our inaugural customer, well, first person to manage to help. And because we didn't find anything really interesting, we're going to give you half everything we found, which unfortunately isn't much. Uh, it. Ravine cleared. Easy job. Here's half of what? I found. Courtesy. Dubco cave lighting. Cave uh, lighting co. There. Hopefully he'll see this. Yeah, there wasn't a whole lot there. I was really hoping to find... Well, you know what? Here. Oh, so there's the coal back in there. I highly doubt Green needs coal like, and like, half a stack of iron, but you guys got to be honest. If I had found something really cool, if I had found a bunch of diamonds, something like that, would give it back to him. After all, it's Christmas, right? Can't be too much of a Scrooge. But I got a chance to do a few more things. We got a chance to check out this. Uh... Oh my god, it's so ugly. It creeps out from under. I mean, it looks so great that it, it creeps out. From under the armor. There we are. Went caving with this spectacular sweater we got from Griff, and it's still in perfect condition. I'd hate to think what would happen if we'd got, oh, I don't know, lit on fire or fell in lava and accidentally lost it. Be, be a real shame, wouldn't it? <laughs> All right, for real, this time. Uh, last video of the year. I will see you guys later.